And you might actually remember that case. It all started here in Billings at the Golden Meadows Trailer Park, where police believed Bryant was inside the home and a standoff lasted for several hours. It turned out he wasn't there, and they ended up making the arrest in Stillwater County. Here's the video of that arrest. As you can see, Bryant exits the vehicle with his hands in the air. This video shot from the inside of the Columbus McDonald's. Charging the defendant, Daryl Colton Bryant, with the offenses of... Cal On Monday, Bryant's trial began with Judge Colette Davies addressing the jury. As such, your primary duty is to decide the disputed issues of fact. Followed by opening statements. He shot all three of them in the small living room of their trailer home. Bryant is facing multiple charges of attempted homicide and criminal endangerment after shooting his wife and son that day, along with his son's friend. Court documents say Bryant kicked down the front door of the home they were in and started firing before the three escaped. Why would a father chase down, break down a door, and shoot to kill his 16-year-old son? All three survived and will likely appear as witnesses. Bryant then allegedly fled the scene with his girlfriend and was arrested later that day. The state encouraged the jury to use their common sense. But as you sit through this trial, please pay attention to the details. But the defense argued that there was more to the story. This American dream was an absolute nightmare for Daryl and he was trapped in a real-life Groundhog Day. Saying that Bryant was justified in his reaction that day due to his abusive living situation. Even if you do find that he intended to kill or cause serious bodily injury, you'll find that he was justified in each of these actions as he protected himself from the immediate fear he felt. The first witness was called to the stand Monday afternoon and the trial is expected to take up to five days and will continue Tuesday morning. In Billings, Charlie Kleps, MTN News.